In this section, we'd like to spend some time reviewing the origins and history of crisis resource management. In 1977, 583 passengers at Tenerife died after the runway crash of a KLM flight and a Pan Am flight that occurred because a Dutch crew used ambiguous communication and did not challenge the captain's decision to take off. In 1978, United Airlines Flight 173 crashed in Portland, Oregon after the plane ran out of fuel while the flight crew was troubleshooting landing gear problems. The National Transportation Safety Board found that a contributory factor for that crash was the captain's failure to accept input from other crew members, as well as the lack of assertiveness from those crew members. During a meeting in the late 1970s, a report by NASA suggested that 70% of airline crashes resulted from human error caused by teamwork failures, specifically through a lack of leadership, team coordination, and decision-making. These errors could not be attributed to weather conditions or equipment malfunctions. Seizing this opportunity in crisis, the term cockpit resource management was applied to the process of training pilots to reduce error by making better use of human resources on a flight deck. In 1979, the National Transportation Safety Board recommended that cockpit resource management training should be required for all airline crews. This training emphasized communication, leadership, and decision-making in the cockpit to manage the resources that were available. These same themes will be echoed throughout this course. By the mid-1980s, cockpit resource management courses emphasized concepts such as team building, briefing strategies, situational awareness, and stress management. And when these courses began including other members of the aviation team and the cabin crew, these courses were renamed crew resource management. When the principles of crew resource management were applied to high acuity environments, such as the operating room, the intensive care unit, the emergency room, and the labor and delivery suite, crew resource management became known as crisis resource management, or CRM. To review, crisis resource management refers to the non-technical skills required for effective teamwork in a crisis situation.